Let's get more insights on this. Very pleased to say that Greg Gilligan joins us now. He's chairman of AmCham China, live out of Beijing. And Greg, what is the survey telling us about the resumption of work in China? Anecdotally, we're hearing more evidence about uh, American businesses in China getting back to business. Is that being reflected in your own numbers? It is, Dan. We have 22% uh, of our member companies say that they've already resumed normal operations. Um, there's another 22% that expect delays to go through the summer. And 35% uh, report over half of employees have returned to the office. Um, but there are still, you know, a good number of companies where 100% continue to, remark, uh, to work remotely. Hmm. So um, getting back to business, but um, incrementally. So what industries or sectors are most likely to feel the full impact of the shutdowns and the spread of the virus? As you'd imagine, it differs sector by sector. Uh, consumer reflects um, a pretty big hit. Um, the tech sector, maybe surprisingly, is um, uh, projecting some pretty optimistic scenario, which is to say uh, a de decrease of less than 5%. And that's 57% of tech sector responders. But if you go to uh, resource and industrials, they're quite pessimistic. There's 38% that um, expect a decrease of 50% or more in market growth this year. 43% uh, in the services sector would expect to take maybe a 35 to 50% decrease in market growth. So, um, you know, it differs as you move from industry to industry. Greg, this is Martin. Let me quickly jump in. So clearly your members are hurting. But what the Fed has done so far and what hopefully Congress is going to do sooner rather than later, is that going to benefit your members or do they or, or, or do they want more still? Well, it, certainly it's welcome, Martin. But we also have uh, demand side challenges because now we're in a global pandemic. The last time we spoke, the uh, epidemic was mostly limited to China and, and its impact here. Uh, now that we're in a global, global pandemic situation, uh, demand for our member companies' products and services has changed significantly, somewhat for reasons of supply chain, but um, others, you know, in uh, really just consumer demand. 